top 10 comic book artists what's up everybody my running kid here coming to you with the opinion spot and this is the next segment um, we all love artists they bring out the color and the, the feel of the hero or whoever whatever the hero or heroine the villain I have many favorite artists but I'm gonna give you my top 10 okay so I hope you guys enjoy it. So um, number 10 on my list has to be Greg Land. Uh, I love Greg Land's artwork. He puts a lot of realism into his uh, artwork. He gives you, especially with the ladies, he gives you a real feel of darker tone as well as, you know, uh, light tone work that he brings to the characters um, and it's something about when he draws girls eyes he gives them that much sparkle into their eyes uh, but I've always like I've, I, Greg Land has always been great and it, when it comes to the guys he draws it's not bad either number nine um, on my list is none other than Jim Lee um, Jim Lee Put so much dexterity and uh, craft in his, to his artwork, especially when it comes to muscle tone. You you see it when he he draws it with the, the men, especially. Um, he puts so much muscle where he makes sure he has every muscle, like whether it's just a regular kick or, as you can see with Bruce right here, him swinging. Look at look how he puts so much muscle into that darker tone work I love um, you know Jim Lee has done it when you get that kind of shade of black and dark of the whatever color the, uh, the character is in it um, but it's always great to see him draw like the DC heroes as well but I first saw him drawing of course X-Men but of course, you know, he's the founder and creator of the Wildcats. So, you know, you got to show Jim Lee some love as well. Number eight on my list is Ed Benz. Uh, Ed Benz is, uh, is Brazilian, yes. And that's not even his full name. But he's another one that knows how to draw the ladies. He draws the ladies well. He draws the guys very well as well um, and you, you know when it's it's uh, Ben's work as well because he kind of he has like a way of drawing females where the, it's kind of like almost a v-shape to begin with you know what I'm saying and then uh, the curves in you know especially with females uh, as you can see with Rogue right here you know um, but Ed Benz is another one of my favorite artists, no doubt about it. Number seven on my list, Billy Tan. I love Billy Tan. Uh, he he doesn't put much, um, you know, where somebody like Ed McGinnis will give you that bulky look of a muscle muscle fiber. He gives you like that toned, that toned slim look of of a character but he pulls it off so well um, but don't get me wrong he can bring out the the beauty of a character um, and now what he's doing right now he's doing Shadowland so that that's great I'm, I'm glad to see him working on the Shadowland series right now um, you're gonna see the work his work of Shadowland right there as you see um, but yeah Billy Tan is another one of my favorite artists uh, his work is very lovely. Number six on my list is Oliver Colpelli. Actually, um, he's he's he made it on my list because his artwork is very very intriguing to me. Um, even though I haven't seen much of his artwork besides you know the, the series like House of M you see right here and uh, his work on. Uh, um, Siege and of course when they rebooted the Thor series as well as you can see right here 
his Thor. I love how he draws Thor. Um, um, so it's really cool to see um, his work come to life as it did, and I'm glad to see he, he's made himself very useful with Marvel. The problem I have with a lot of these artists, I don't like when an artist is exclusive to one company. I think an artist should be able to go wherever they sh want to go. You know what I'm saying? Because I would love to see some exclusive DC artists draw Marvel characters as well as some exclusive Marvel characters draw DC and any of and any other character that are not in those two big publications. But those are the first five. The next five is coming very soon, very quickly, I should say. But you guys tell me what you think of my ten through six so far. Um, and you know, you know me, guys. I would love to hear your thoughts on your choices as well. But we all have our favorites. These, this is just my opinion of my favorites. Um, and I would hope you would respect that and vice versa I will respect your your choices as well but this is just 10 through 6 I will give you 5 to 1 very soon um, and uh, I hope you enjoy what you saw I made sure I not just showed you an image of the artist but some of their artwork as well you know it I give all these artists every artist credit where credit is due but this is Mom Vernon Kid saying peace, one love, stay tuned, catch you later.